All right, shalom again, Rastafari. We have to get a better, a better idea, a working idea. So we're trying to create some maps, and here we're using the Google, the Google, um, the Google Earth, right? And you see, we're searching Shashimani, Ethiopia, right? So now here's what they call the Jamaican Sefer. Now let's understand this carefully. Jamaican Sefer. It says Jamaican Sefer. Sefer means area. Jamaican means the Jamaican area. What they mean in Ethiopia is that the Rastafari, really the black people of the West, and mainly the Rastafari, which are African American as well as Jamaican, as well as other of the so called um, artificial names that were given. This land was originally given the 500 or so hectares of land. And if we zoom out, let's see if we can get this uh, right here and zoom out, right? We're going to zoom out, right? As we zoom out, you notice as we zoom out, we see uh, Shashimani, Ethiopia. This is the main, this is the natives. You could say the Oromo, the Oromo people, the native people's town right here, the, the city, uh, the main municipality. Now, this is the area, the allotment, right, the area of the allotment as we zoom in. Now, watch this map. As we back up, as we zoom in, you can see as we, as we get closer and closer, you can see as we get closer, the Jamaican Sefer, really it should be the EWF Sefer, the Ethiopian World Federation Sefer. It's not the property of Jamaica, you see what I'm saying, and therefore not of England the mother country it is of the Ethiopian World Federation or we the black people but it's interesting looking at this map right here because we can see how much how much has been um, settled so as you as you look right here you can see that there's there's all this other land let's see if we can there's all this other land and all this is a part of the land now you hear a lot of rumors there's a lot of rumors going on you know, and concerning how the land that was given to us has been all taken over. But see, the land can't go anywhere, our brothers and sisters. The first thing we need to do is to become familiar with what's going on and utilize these tools. These are some incredible tools here. And this is why we're bringing it, you know, I'm sure some of you all probably went here and looked around or something, or hopefully you will go here and look around, you know, put in... Um, Shashimani, um, Oromia, Ethiopia, because the region is called Oromia, right? And then as we go over here, we can see that there's all of this land. As we go to uh, go over here to the, I think this would be the north, south, um, north, south, east, and west. So we're going to the east. So you see all this land. Look at all this land. Now, some of it might be farmland, some might be other land, but the, the land that has been given to us is ours in perpetuity. Let's recognize those facts. In Ethiopian law, there's your agarist soul. Kashiyametuodaristu. Now, because of disunity, because of infighting, because of a lack of the al kidan breaking that covenant of the Federation. This is why this is the only area so far, this square right here, that we can say that we really have any sort of claim on. But all this land here, my brothers and sisters, is our land. You understand? When we talk about the 500 hectares, perhaps other portions of land has been taken over. This is these are other communities here. You understand? But this right here, is our land. Don't let what it says Jamaican Sefer throw you, my brothers and sisters. You understand? No, I allow this for those who are Jamaican to make you too proud because right now they call him Jamaican because all Rastafarians, too many Ethiopians who still lack education of who we are and even of who they are and even of his imperial majesty, moreover, the truth. You see, a lot of the truth over these years has been um, misrepresented, has been distorted, so forth and so on. So that's a distortion, a major distortion there. But 
But let's not get caught up on that right now, on those names, because we have the documents, we have the paperwork. I just want to, to make a comparison and to show you all what has been settled, right, and what still needs to be settled. You understand what still needs to be settled. You see all that land right there? All that land right there. We can even go closer and see all this land that still is there for us. This is to dispel the rumors. You see, a lot of folks are going over there without the proper authority and not being in the proper order. You understand? And not going over there with the right spirit. You see, so they're not, some folks don't got the right information. They can get on the plane and they can travel, but they're just like the false um, um, witnesses. Remember the 12, the 12 who were sent to spy out the land? And only two said, we can go in there and the land is ours. Don't worry about the giants. Jah is with us. But the people believed all these false witnesses. Look at this land, my people. Look at this land. We're going to the south, even further south. There is land. It's whether we really have the settler and the pioneer spirit, whether we really have the covenant spirit to do what we need to do, get in our proper person, get our paperwork, work together, watch and pray. You understand? Because we don't have that faith amongst ourselves. We won't be able to pool our resources you won't be able to trust one another. We won't have any sort of government or order amongst us, any sort of true churchical spirit. You know what I'm saying? So there's some church groups out there, and even some of the Israelites out there, that, that if they get over the ignorance concerning his majesty and concerning Ethiopia and start to put it together, you see, what his majesty gave us, for we, the black people of the world. And this was just the beginning. But this shows that of the land that he gave us, only a little bit has so far been settled. And this is the area right here. Once again, this needs to be, this needs to be updated. You understand? This really needs to, because there's a lot of brothers and sisters there who are not just Jamaican, but of course, Jamaican to the Ethiopian, to the uneducated Ethiopians, Rasta equals Jamaican. Rastafari equals Jamaican. But now we do know better, and we know that this Sefer or this area is Ethiopian World Federation. This is, this is just a portion of that. But when you start to hear folks say, well, there's no more land. Well, if you go to the city area, the city portion, as you can see, the city portion right here, here's the main city. Here's the main hub of the city. It's interesting as we, let's see if we can pull this out, son. You understand? Know as we pull it out, we can see a little bit more. So you can see how that's the main city right there, right? And this is as we're coming more and more out, more and more out, more and more out. So you can see where on the map we are at. Now as we go more and more in, right, let's, as we go more and more in, more and more in. Let's get closer. Let's get closer. Like let's get closer. Let's move over. Okay, let's move over. Let's get closer in here. And as you can see, as we're getting closer, let's move up a little bit more north. That's the area right there. Right, the Jamaican suffer. So let's move over. Right, let's move over. Right there. So now. This, at this angle, we can see it even a little bit better. This is the EWF. This is the portion of the land grant that has been settled. And all of this is, is more land. You understand? And there's also more land on the other side as well. So there's not a lack of land. You see what I'm saying? But there's a lack of coordination. There's a lack of working together. You understand? There's a lack of investment. There's a lack of us acting on our faith, not just talking about it. You see, as soon as people hear, oh, there's no more land, rah, 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 they start to lose heart. But there's more land, my people, and this, this is just one evidence. This is just one piece of evidence. As we get closer, that's 
the only area that has been settled so far and look over here. So we have to become familiar with these maps. Just like we have to become familiar with the law. Familiar with Torah. So we talk about no tithes. This is the land from the land in which we were tithed. You see what I'm saying? So we're coming to enrich Ethiopia, to improve its economy, to invest in Ethiopia. You understand? This is no pie-in-the-sky dream. This is reality, my brothers and sisters. So we're just showing you some pics of Shashimani and our land grant, the Ethiopian World Federation land grant. You understand? It might be difficult after 40 years, you know, seeing that so much has not been done. Remember the Israelites, they were wandering in the wilderness for 40 years. And when they finally did come into the promised land after wandering in the wilderness because of lack of faith and disobedience, there was a fight. They had to fight for their land. If that is necessary for us, so be it. You understand? We don't have to be like the Jews. We are the real Hebrews, those who represent the lion of the tribe of Judah. So I just want you to know all of this land. But now what are we to do with this land? We've got to farm this land. You know what We've got to enrich in the land. We've got to work hard. We've got to sweat for the land. But there's steps that we need to take while we're here right now to get into our proper person and to preserve, reclaim our birthright, preserve it, and live within the covenant. Because that's what's necessary to truly be successful. You understand? To truly be successful. I'm just, I'm just, you know, it's just wonderful to just be able to see this and to show this and demonstrate all this is land. All this is land that could be feeding not just Shashimeni, but also parts of Ethiopia as well as parts of Africa. That's our economy there. Land is the real wealth. This is the real, real estate. As we just look through here, and we, we, we're going southward, and you just keep seeing more and more tracts of land. You know what I'm saying? You just keep seeing more and more tracts of land, brothers and sisters. So this, this is the goal. You know what I'm saying? This is the goal. You know what I'm saying? This is the goal. But in order to be worthy of this goal, we have to watch and pray. We have to study. 